Hey guys, in this video we're going to be uh, preparing and cooking uh, pork spare ribs on an outdoor smoker. So what the finished product looks like here. So what I got here is I got two slabs of St. Louis style uh, spare ribs. Uh, these are the uh, the more square type bones rather than the round ones that you see in like the baby back. And you can see they have the, the back membrane attached to these. So what you want to do is you want to strip that membrane off uh, prior to smoking these. The easiest way I do it is I start at a corner and I just start gently peeling uh, until I got a large enough piece where I can just start stripping off that single piece, uh, just tearing it uh, basically sideways. It's quite a slippery job. So what I got here is I got a paper towel. That I'm using to grab onto that membrane uh, and pull while I'm stripping it off. After that's done, I'm going to be using my basic rub of uh, Pappy's, and we're going to be generously uh, applying that to both sides uh, of these ribs. We're going to be smoking these today on my Oklahoma Joe's uh, offset smoker, seen here. Inside I got my water pan. I've got my firebox, which I've slightly modified. I've actually raised my, my grade a bit. And we're going to be using Kingsford charcoal. And I got my chimney starter on the left there. And we're going to be using pecan wood. What we got here is we got a vertical rib rack which we're going to be um, installing our ribs on. So we're going to be putting these ribs top down um, into each of the slots. And I got a set of beef ribs there in the back also. Be doing a separate video on that. So my fire's ready to go in my chimney. I dump that into my firebox with some unlit coals that are already in the firebox. We're going to let that go. I'm at my target temperature, which is about uh, 225, 230. So I'm going to add these uh, ribs along with my rack to the far left of my smoker. I'm going to watch my temperature here. I'm mostly watching the temperature on the left, like here. I want to keep that between 225 and 230 if I can. I'm about an hour into cooking here, so I'm going to add some of my uh, soaked pecan chunks, and I'm going to be doing that hourly. All right, so we're four and a half hours in here. So I'm bringing these off. I'm going to take these in the house. I'm going to slice these up individually. And we are ready to eat. So you go pork spare ribs. Smoked my Oklahoma Joe's offset smoker. Took about four hours. And there you have it. Thank you for watching. Catch you guys later.